The African continent is home to 24 of the 25 poorest countries on Earth. Fully 75% of Africans live on less than $2 a day. And only one out of five people have access to the financial services they need to work their way out of poverty. That's why Opportunity International is establishing a network of banks across sub-Saharan Africa to transform the lives of millions of families. The vision for Opportunity's Banking on Africa campaign is to open microfinance banks that bring impoverished people into the financial system. These banks will help people lift themselves out of poverty and will mobilize capital that can be reinvested back into the economy. We use these very savings that we collect from people to lend out so that communities can get better and better. For every one loan that you make, there are three or four people that actually want to open a savings account with you. And these are not large accounts. This gives them security. It gives them the first step on the ladder to acquiring some form of wealth. We were very poor. I had no fields, no livestock, and many problems. Clementine Uzabakirio of Rwanda demonstrates what opportunity clients can accomplish with one small loan and a savings account. I started selling one sack of sorghum and now I'm selling over 1,000 sacks a week. Now in her 11th loan cycle, Clementine hires 41 people from her village for her thriving sorghum business. With her profits, she has built a new home, purchased livestock, enrolled her children in school, and helped her community build a new church. Currently, Opportunity has formal financial institutions serving the poor in six African countries. One of Opportunity's greatest challenges is reaching the vast rural population. Through innovations like mobile banks and biometric identification, Opportunity is making access to financial services a growing reality. Clients deposit their profits at the Opportunity Mobile Bank that makes a weekly stop within walking distance at home, saving valuable time and money. Opportunity's goal in sub-Saharan Africa is to provide savings, loans, insurance, and training to over 5 million clients, helping to improve the lives of 30 million people by the year 2015. You're starting with the people who can make a difference, and that's the workers themselves. They need capital, business know-how, and they need markets. I strongly believe that microfinance institutions, 10 years from now, the level of poverty in Africa might be reduced by half, if not even beyond. <laughs>